Hello everybody, I'm Adam Bilsing and this is the Dirty Bandana Drum Project where we do daily deep dives into every aspect of playing the drums. Today is a sight reading day, one of my favorite types of days. That just means we're going to choose a card at random from Alfred's Music Publishing Drum Set Rhythms Playing Card Pack. Shuffle it up, draw, never seen it before, never tried it before, and we're going to truly sight read it. Learn it right here on the spot all together. So without a lot more talking, let's get right into it, see what I draw today, and learn that thing. All right, time to shuffle up, draw a card, and see what we're going to be working on today. Just as a reminder, I've already taken out all of the cards that we've done in the past, so we're not going to get any repeats, and there's nothing in here that I've worked on before, ever. So we're truly sight reading today, and I really hope that this one goes a little easier than last week. The merengue last week really kicked my butt. So let's see what we draw. I see a six of diamonds. Oh, this is a brush pattern, and I'm not wearing the brush snare drum. So we're redrawing. First time I've done that, that's fine. <clears throat> we'll save that for later. Try again. All right. Six of clubs. The Bo Diddley beat. Hey, Bo Diddley. All right, so uh, let's go through what we normally go through. Yeah, okay. This is kind of a modified 3-2 sewn clave, basically. Um, but we all know it in the Western world from uh, early rock and roll. So let's look at the instrumentation and the stuff that we always look at when we're doing sight reading. First things first, time signature. 4-4 four, four time, nice and easy. Quarter note gets the beat, four beats per measure. I said that backwards, four beats per measure, quarter note gets the beat. All right, so we've got snare drum and kick drum and that's it, no cymbals anywhere on this. And we have accents, the kick drum and the snare drum are hitting the accents together, alternating right and left hand on the snare drum. This looks pretty basic, so let's see if we can really get it to groove. First things first, the accents. All right, and you can hear me already playing it swung. I want to play it swung, not straight. Uh, that's because I already got the Bo Diddley groove in my head. Okay, pretty simple, kind of what we expected. I'm noticing a trouble spot right away. Accented left hand and right foot. Within the pattern, my limbs aren't falling at exactly the same moment and they're trying to make a flam. So that's something I'll be working on as I play this. Uh, but like I said, when I first started to play it, it was swung, not straight. So I wanna say that we can do this both ways. Straight. That's the wrong melody. Um, anyway, that's what it looks like. Pretty simple, I like it a lot. Let's put up the click track and see what this sounds like at a couple different tempos. We're gonna try this at 80 beats per minute straight and then swung.
Okay, that's going to do it for today's sight reading session from the Dirty Bandana Drum Project featuring the Six of Clubs from Alfred's Music Publishing Drum Set Rhythms Playing Card Pack, the Bo Diddley Beat. And I need to go listen to some Bo Diddley to get myself hip again. If you want to follow along and make sure you don't miss any episodes upcoming from the Dirty Bandana Drum Project, go ahead and like and subscribe below. You can also catch me over on Twitter and Instagram and Facebook and YouTube at Dirty Bandana. That's right, they all know me by name now. And you can get all the details for everything about the Dirty Bandana Drum Project, predictably, at DirtyBandana.com. That's it for now. We'll see you all next time.